NASA plans to launch new missions to examine the life cycle of stars. These NASA missions will study the birth of stars and how they die in the Milky Way. The Water Recovery X-ray rocket WRX will launch on April 4, 2018, and the Colorado High Resolution is Shell Stellar Spectrograph Chef 4 on April 13. The both missions will launch on NASA Black Grand IX sounding rocket. From the launching location, the WRX mission focuses around the Vela Supernova Remnant and measures soft X-rays. The Vela Supernova Remnant created when the star, more prominent than 10 times the mass of the Sun, collapsed and then exploded as a supernova. Supernova Remnant Supernova Remnants are good to study due to their proximity, which makes them large, bright targets on the sky, said Randy Sentak, principal investigator of the WRX. WRX measurements will allow scientists to derive information about the atmospheric conditions in the Vela Supernova Remnant. The WRX is the first sounding rocket mission to use a newly developed NASA water recovery system for astronomical payloads. However, most NASA astronomical suborbital rocket missions allow for land recovery of the highly valued payload. While, both WRX and CHEF for instruments have already flown from White Sands. Star Gamma A a powerful stellar wind the CHEF 4 mission will study the matter between stars. The mission focuses on translucent clouds of gas that provide the principal building blocks of stars and planets. CHEF will point at the star Gamma A in a group of stars they look. While, the Gamma A shows an unusually powerful stellar wind. CHEF will also examine the interaction of stellar wind with the surrounding interstellar medium to study about the excitation of atoms and molecules in the interface region. This iteration of CHEF also features a refreshed instrument, the retuned spectrograph which gives roughly 4 to 5 times higher spectral resolution than previous quality. The higher spectral resolution is perfect for observing excited molecules against the background signal created by the interstellar medium, 